Hey, what up, Z Clan? Oh, hold on a second. What are you doing? I'm trying to make an intro, bad boys. <laughs> what up, Z Clan? How you doing, and everybody else? Welcome to Fallout 76. My outfit 100% guaranteed to find locations. Now, in this episode, we're gonna cover the military cap. So, I know two exact locations where you can find them that I remember off. I'm making a list now of everything what I find and if it's a randomized location or if it's 100% guaranteed. So the first cap can be easily found in Mothman in this sort of village here. In Z Point Pleasant. <laughs> so if you go inside obviously there are gonna be a lot of level 1 scorches which is pretty easy for me right now. Since I'm a little bit higher level and I got an AK and then you enter this door, there are going to be a couple of... I already killed them. <laughs> so, pretty much, there it is, that military cap. There we go. That's the first military cap. Usually it appears somewhere right here on the table. And sometimes it happens that to be on the floor. Uh, I don't know why that is, but that's the case. But I found these mil this military cap, like dozens of times in the same location so I'm pretty sure that you're gonna be you you are gonna be able to locate it as well right and it looks pretty cool plus the military theory fatigues I already covered in the previous video so if you want to find where that is just take a look in the previous video now let's move on to the second location where I'll have an additional tip for you alright so here's the second location and the second location is the uh, monograph power plant so over here there are going to be two tips I'm going to, actually three, tips I'm going to give you in addition to finding the military cap. So first of all, this campaign hat always spawns here as well. I'm going to make a separate video just for it as well later on. So that's one. Two, the military cap, lock it in right in the next tent, right? And three, if you did not know, uh, in Fallout 76, you can have your own camp, right? That's one. Uh, two, you can have a second uh, camp. It's called more of like settlement or whatever. So what you will have to do is run over here, kill the enemy like that one, like that guy right there. It triggers, right? Plus, oh my god, this guy just doesn't want to die. Level 28. <laughs> and three! You get to capture this workshop. So afterwards, it gives you additional resources to build. So you'll be able to build over here, and uh, you will get the ability to build the machine to grab all the silver you want and toxic waste. Silver, I don't know what it's for. I think maybe it's for um, for power armor. My best guess, by the way. Uh, the toxic right behind me, you will mainly require it to craft gunpowder which you will use to craft the ammunition right so you'll put your thing over here it requires 10 power and that requires 10 power as well uh, usually I come here just to get the toxic thing and uh, build water purified water pumps like three or four so I get to solve my problem with purified water now I do this only if I know that I'm gonna be playing the game for over two actually over three hours because Whenever you capture this, first of all, it costs caps. So when you want to activate it, it will. This workshop cannot be claimed nearby enemies. Okay, I have I haven't cleared out the enemy enemies, so I need to find other guys in order to clear to get it right. But eventually, it will tell you you gotta pay 30 caps, and there you go, you can build in the settlement. The only thing, the only problem is, is that <clears throat> uh, if you log out or you get kicked out, this all what you build disappears <laughs> yeah it's weird but it that's the case <clears throat> it disappears but uh, whenever you capture that thing it gives you materials to build what you want and sometimes if you want to overbuild uh, you get to waste your own materials right but it's a really good thing to get additional resources uh, straight up off the bat now another problem here some other players might want to take this over from you once you've built it. <laughs> so it will trigger PvP essentially uh, players that try and depending on how much damage they did to your base or uh, 
basically how many of them are there, they're gonna get a bounty. So I had this happen to me when I was level 10 and three guys of level 20 and above just came here and start, started messing with my my money making machine that happened in the first episode uh, I mean on the first live stream I did if you want to check it out I have a timestamp over there <laughs> of the combat I killed the guys by the way it was funny I had low ammo I was low level the guy had a power uh, armor he ended up having a bounty on his head for 230 caps that was insane so yeah I, I got to make some decent caps by killing these dudes I mean it was cool it was fun but yeah it gives you the ability to build more uh, protection so you'll be able to have protection but uh, you need to kind of um, balance it out so you neither put tons of protection and a little bit of water and a little bit of toxic or a little bit more of toxic and a little bit more of water and silver but less protection because you have a budget when you build right so that's another tip over here for you so I think that's pretty much it and that's the cap that's the military fatigues if you haven't watched it it's in the previous video if there's something interesting a hundred percent to find I will find of the clothes then uh, I will do some more I think I'm actually in the next video I'm gonna cover uh, T skirt and the shacks I I almost double checked and I think I found the location where they spawn a hundred percent to find because sometimes you know uh, our these things don't appear where you think they want to appear basically what I'm trying to say is at one point it has like an outfit there but if someone else comes or you come there again it will be something else so as I said there are randomized locations and there are a hundred percent guaranteed locations so I'm trying to bring here the 100% guaranteed. And by the way, if you found those military caps that I've shown you, please do comment down below. Let me know that they are there and we're all good. <laughs> Alright, Z-Clan and everybody else, I hope you enjoyed this video. And you have a good morning, day and night. Whatever you guys lock it at. And by the way, happy Thanksgiving Day. Cheers. Bye.